on back. Well, I wanted the grenade launcher to see if I could steal pieces of their mounting system. We're going to give that a shot and see how it works out. That's amazing. Is that the machine? That's it. Take a look? Yeah, go ahead. Nice. Here we go, Will. Wrong one. It's a military style? Yeah. Well, we got our grenade launcher. Unfortunately, it was a military replica. Turned out it was the wrong thing. The problem with the setup Joe found is that it would require an extensive modification of the rifles that Marco's department already has. So at this point, there's only one thing left that I can actually do with it. You don't mind if I try it, huh? Absolutely not. All right, let's go f up the neighbors. They're going to get so busted. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh my god, that thing's gorgeous. <laughs> it was also very underpriced. 15 and we're done? 15. 15 and we're done. All right, All right. I'm gonna take it. was spectacular. And it definitely reminded the neighbors of who they're putting up with. It does not help me one bit on my current project. On the other hand, that's the coolest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Chris, you got that ready? Almost, sir. Fire in the hole! The search for the grenade launcher turned out to be a total red hair. It didn't help us a darn bit with this master key project. On the other hand, it did help me become the owner of a grenade launcher, so I'm still okay with that. Dad! Where did this come from? Where did it come from? Oh, that's Will's new toy. And Dad bought it. Yeah. Yeah. He shot it, too. Once he shot it, he had to buy it. He shot it already? Yeah. Without me? Yeah. So he spent my money on it, and he shot it without me? Yeah. Oh, that's that's exactly. I'll try to take oh. your mind off this 1500 your dad just spent oh. on it. Um. Please tell me you're kidding. I kind of flipped out when I seen Dad bought a grenade launcher. You give him an inch, he takes 1500 bucks. I'm going to kill him. Dad does this all the time. He has to go, oh, it's my overtime money. What is this? Uh, no, 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 come here. Uh, uh, uh. That's my overtime for the next two weeks. Are you kidding me? Three weeks. So what exactly was your purpose in owning one of these? The sheer inability to continue life without it. <laughs> Dad better watch out. If he doesn't sell at least three of these master keys, I'm selling that grenade launcher. We're gonna have to get back on our own drawing board, and luckily, Plan B was already in effect. Vince never stopped working on one version of a mount in order for it to all hold together. Vince, you know, as cool as this is, that will never do. Yeah, it would never work. I think it would fall apart with the first round, even if we got it on there. How are you coming with that double mount? We got a few more cuts to make on the mill, and we should be good. Better to make a few more cuts, because this definitely ain't, ain't yeah, doing it, okay? Let's get this puppy rolling. My concern with mounting two weapons together is uh, that we got to make sure that the hardware that mounts the two together is perfectly secure. Otherwise, uh, during recoil, you could have the two systems detached from one another, which would be a catastrophic failure when somebody got hurt in the process. We needed to work day after day, year after year. Lives are at stake at this. Dude, that thing better be ready. It's good. Check it. Good to go. It's a freaking gun right here, man. That's it, huh? It's awesome. It ain't no wobbly wobbly 203, man. All right, so. Boom. Yep. OK, now that will work. Yeah. Mounted a 12-gauge shotgun on an M16 rifle to create a breaching tool and assault rifle in one. Next thing is test firing it, make sure everything works properly, holds together, and that the weapon cycles. Chris, you got that ready? Almost, sir. I think so. Vince, I'm going live. All right. Fire in the hole. Check my mounts. All right. What do you think? I feel like 
Jesus just slept. While the gun went boom and the door went bye-bye, uh, I'm less than thrilled with the mount. I think we can eliminate half of the mechanism and actually increase the strength of it. Look, that, that double mount thing, Mm -hmm. That was good in theory. That wasn't so good in actual practice, okay? What I want to do is take out that bottom one. I want to see a redo. Permanently attach it, lock it Semi in. Semi-permanently attached to the shotgun and then Correct. It'll... Have fun with that. I'm going to have Vince take the bottom portion of our mounting system completely out of the design, do a little milling, and see if we can snug in just the top half of our mount. And we'll just leave that permanently attached to the shotgun. I'll catch you uh, about an hour and a half. All right, sounds good. Bye-bye. In an hour and a half, I'm selling this as a working product. You through? No. Let me see. Dude, that's perfect. I know. Oh, yes, we are breaching doors. Well, we're taking this master key out today. We're going to put it through its paces for our boys in blue. It could open up a whole new market for us. Marcos, how you doing, man? Good, good, brother. Good Lord, you brought the whole crew. Ah, how you how doing, you? fellas? How, how you doing? doing? Well, gentlemen, we have dubbed this the master key. Ooh, she looks pretty. So what you'll be able to do is go straight from blowing the door to blowing your target. We all about that. Absolutely. I'll tell you, it's fully my intention to change what standard door breaching is. Well, let's try her out, man. Well, I'm, I'm anxious to see what all she right, can do. All right, let's do it. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be breaching the door and taking out the bad guys on the other side of the door. It means everything has to work. The shotgun, the transition, the mount, the M16. You're live and rock and roll, my brother. Right. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going to get the hell up out your way. <laughs> You're always 100% confident right to the moment you hand it to your customer. That's cool stuff. It really is. Well, sweet. This thing's an animal. All in one. Awesome. First time on it. How did the transition work for you? Going from uh, shotgun to rifle. Transition was good. You know, going from a breaching tool to a yeah, rifle. Yeah, you're not, you're not used to having to make that back step. That's all first time. Exactly. It was great. Shot smooth. Reached the hell out of that door. Yes, sir. It's a rare opportunity, and I feel a privilege, you know, to be able to just come in here and work directly with you. I want you guys to be safe, man. Hell, the life you save might be mine. <laughs> Roger always, that. buddy, always. Bottom line is, for us to make a profit, people have to actually come back and order these weapons. And if this guy doesn't come back in and order at least three of these master keys, it's doing me no good, and bye-bye, <laughs> grenade launcher. Hey, Dad. Hey, man. How are you, daddy -o? I'm good. Good, 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 good. So, the timing, everything is exactly what they were looking for. Love the weapon. So, I want to see if we can purchase at least eight of them to start out with. Excellent. Yes. And I brought you a cigar for the fat lady to sing. I couldn't be more pleased. In four days, we went from say could you to I'll take it. All right, it made me feel like going back and giving all the boys a raise. I'm kidding and don't tell them that. Frankly, uh, I got the base units here. We'll probably have the guns ready by the time the paperwork gets back from ATF. Okay, excellent. Liking it. Thank, Thank you, you man. Appreciate it. Right. Eight. Eight? Eight. 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 Looks like Dad gets to keep his grenade launcher after all. We actually sold eight of those master keys at $3,000 a piece, which puts us at $24,000. I'm 
I'm going to bask in glory. <laughs> he loves your cigar, huh? Nice. Eight. Eight. And I don't want to hear crap about buying this. Come here. What? Because I sold eight. Put your hand right here and pull that. Oh, just shoot the thing. That's why you spend fifteen hundred dollars on a grenade launcher, uh, I... so that you can launch grenades. Oh, 